But we begin with the Bobcats. It is the Battle of Unbeatens this Friday morning. The undefeated Whiteford Bobcats return to the state championship game and are set to face another unblemished team in Nouvelle Catholic Central. Kickoff bright and early, 10 a.m. on Friday at Ford Field up in Detroit. Now, aside from a morning practice on Thanksgiving Day, the team will spend the holiday with their families. Coach Jason Mensing says they're ready, and he is not worried about anyone showing up in a food coma, except maybe himself. You only live once. I've never <laughs> been one to turn down a second piece of pie. So, no, we, we'll, uh, we'll, uh, our, they're, they're teenagers. They're going to they're gonna feel fine come Friday. I'm the one who probably won't uh, recover quite as fast from a, a big turkey dinner. We're just really grateful. Uh, we're not looking down as it's ruining our Thanksgiving. It's just another week with our family, our extended family, and uh, get some bonding time in the morning and then just try to eat light. Maybe not get that second play, get to bed early and get ready for Friday. Pie, love pie. Here it is, Division 8 State Final up at Ford Field, Nouvelle Central Catholic, Gary it. Video proof, unbeaten against the Bobcats as Whiteford makes their second consecutive trip up to Ford Field and the state championship game. 10 a.m. once again kickoff bright and early with more on this one. Here is the pigskin professor, BCSN's Mike Jewell. Congratulations, Jason Mensing, the Whiteford Bobcats. Second year in a row, 13-0, and you're heading towards championship weekend in the state of Michigan. That's right, championships are this weekend, and for the Whiteford Bobcats, it's going to be Friday morning at 10 a.m., so you either hold off on the Black Friday shopping or maybe take a break in the midst of it to go see the Whiteford Bobcats and their run with destiny. What a season it's been. What a career for the seniors. Eitner, Atherton, Tesnar, and the rest of them playing so ferociously on both sides of the football. They've got an opponent this week. It's Saginaw Nivelle. Catholic Central, a tough team with a history story tradition and also 13-0. This will be a great matchup. Expect Whiteford to continue to do what they do offensively. That's Logan Murphy with 25 plus touchdowns, approaching 200 points on the season, running so brilliantly tackle to tackle, but there's other weapons as well on offense behind Tesnar and Atherton. Tommy Eitner, I think, has been the key his entire career at Whiteford, running the quarterback show, running the ball with discipline, throwing the ball at almost a 70% clip. Zach Burtz is a weapon to get to the edge make big plays, and the addition of receiver, Braden Clark Gilmore is a big play guy with Eitner. This offense is running on all cylinders. They do what they do, and I think the Whiteford Bobcats are gonna trust the process, but the wrinkles that they came in with in last week's semifinal game against the Menden Hornets, I think put Menden back on their heels a bit and allowed Whiteford to roll in a brilliant effort for semifinal weekend. Whiteford. Trust your process, trust your routine. Maybe go with that typical Thursday night pregame meal as opposed to a Thanksgiving fest and save the turkey and cranberry for Friday night. Good luck, go get it, you've earned it, and oh my goodness, thank you for a wonderful, wonderful four years with that senior class.